Hey guys, what's going on? It's iPod Tech Support here. Um, I'm going to be showing you how to uh, just jailbreak your iPhone or I, uh, iPod Touch with the uh, Red Snow. Um, this is for the 3.0 software. Um, I'm going to warn you guys that the Red Snow is kind of buggy. I've used it on my iPhone a few times and I've, I've re jailbroken my iPhone, I don't know, maybe five or six times now with it because it's crashed. Um, Restarting my iPhone has been the most pain. As soon as you start the phone up, it just locks on the black screen. So I had to set it into a restore mode and restore my iPhone. But if you want to give this a test run, you're just going to have to go ahead and bear with it. I mean, some people haven't had that much of a problem with it. Some people have. Um, I guess I'm just one of the unlucky ones. But QuickPwn 3.0 should be out pretty soon. I hope it is. I don't know when, but uh, hopefully the dev team's working on it. But, um, I'm going to be giving you guys a tutorial on how to do this. So, I always keep a thing called the jailbreak package. I made a, video, uh, a folder of it. Actually, I put it on my USB port, my USB uh, drive. Um, it's a 3.0. I have 2.2.1 jailbreak. You guys should do this just in case you lose anything. You always got backups. This is the original mobile installation. This is the original. That's the modded one. In case you want to, yeah, change the mobile installation, but. Here we go. Uh, first, you want to do is open up your Red Snow application. Okay, welcome to Red Snow. It's going to ask you to browse for the uh, IPSW. I'm going to give you the IPSW in the uh, description, so just browse for that. Mine is right here. Make sure it's make sure yours is the right one. This is the iPhone uh, right here, 3.0. This is for my iPhone. You got to make sure you're, you're picking the right one. Okay, it's going to look for it. Oh, and uh, please subscribe. Uh, it's always good when people subscribe. I appreciate it, guys. Uh, and please rate and comment this. It always helps. Okay. Okay, IPSW successfully identified. Now I'm going to switch to my webcam really quick and show you exactly what you have to do. All right. Hey, guys. Now everything is ready. Red Snow is ready. Uh, I already browsed for the uh, IPSW, found it. You want to click next. Install Cydia. Now this has to be turned off. So, turn it off. And it's got to be plugged in. Okay. Then the next screen is going to show you the steps to do this. Give it one second. Wow, it takes a while to turn down. Okay, now it's powered off. Start it again. Click next, and you want to hit this button, that, and then let go. So, here you go. Alright, hold that for three seconds. And then you press down the home button. And then let go of the power button at the top. There, now I'm only holding this. And you have to hold this for about 20 seconds. I let go when it hits the white screen, and that's good enough. Okay. Now I'm letting go. Waiting for the reboot. Alright, and you guys know, I mean, once you uh, jailbreak with Red Snow, you can do all the cool stuff like Winterboard and changing your themes and downloading different things. And Installus is a pretty good one to get. Um, instead of going to appylo.us, you can just get a, uh application from Cydia and you can just. Uh, download that and then you can download free applications directly from your iPod so that, w that way you don't have to even go on the uh, internet and if you have the iPhone 3G and you're working on the 3G network you don't even need uh, Wi-Fi to do this so yeah you know upgrading and doing a jailbreaking is pretty it's pretty cool um, I think anybody that is in the original state of their iPhone like a non-jailbreak I think you guys should try it out 
nothing can really go bad with jailbreaking. Even if you get it um, bricked, there's always a way to unbreak your phone. Um, if it gets stuck on the Apple logo or anything like that, I mean, there's so many different things and how to how to fix it out there. Um, just look it up, you know. Just search uh, how to get out of the I don't know Apple stuck logo. You know, it, it pops up everywhere. Um, a good place to go to is modmyeye.com. It's a really really good forum. They show you how to do everything. Okay, now this is done. Click finish. Now it's going to uh, download jailbreak data. Once this is finished, I'll uh, get back with you guys. And oh, there you go. Hold on. It's going to be replacing the kernels and flashing now. This is what takes a while. All right. So when this is finished, I'll show you guys what happened. All right, guys. Uh, all finished, and this is what you get. You got Cydia. All right. Well. City is what you need, and uh, once you have jailbroken this and finished everything, then uh, you're good to go. You can get Winterboard. Right. See right there. All right, Winterboard. Make sure you change your themes and do stuff like that, which is pretty cool. So uh, please, you guys, subscribe, 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 and rate and comment. But uh, definitely subscribe. Thanks. I'm gonna have a whole bunch more videos. Uh, pretty soon once I start getting uh, some more cases from my iPhone and stuff like that um, right now as you, you can tell I have the well you can't really tell but I have the video of my Zag invisible shield I have that on the, have that on there right now so once you guys um, subscribe I mean I'll start getting some more uh, videos out there and I appreciate it guys thanks